The first day of filming uh, in Sonoma was to basically to really film the cars in a real environment. So Sonoma, the town, is, is, is a great, quiet place where most people know it for its wine. So you have, you know, vineyards all over and it's a beautiful scenery and also has the Sonoma Raceway. We shot in a location that really gave us a flavor of the area and also really showed the car off. We're gonna be trying to capture the car in a very lean profile for this segment. Um, there's some nice green rolling hills that are rolling all the way through 116 and it should be, you know, quite beautiful back here. When you're shooting, the day starts to go by really quick and you're trying to get the final shots and we wanted to shoot the interiors and some exterior beauties on the first day. Shooting car interiors is always kind of a struggle. We have this large camera, how are we gonna get the camera into the car. We're racing light at this point in time. Usually with interiors you want to make the light as soft and as even as possible and to do that you have to utilize your grip and lighting team. We've got about 10 minutes of light going on right now and we are trying our best to get all the interiors done right now. We're kind of racing with the clouds and hopefully the sun's going to break in about another three minutes and that'll give us the enough light to shoot the close-ups of the interior. The sun is just about to drop below the horizon. Mike, the car good? And, uh, we're getting set up, but it's a mad scramble here. We're just trying to push through and trying to get through before we lose light, and hopefully uh, we do it. So. All right, everybody, thank you very much. That's a wrap. So on our second day, we were actually at Sonoma Raceway, and that was the big production day. We spend, you know, a month, a month and a half preparing for this shoot. And all of a sudden, on shoot days, we have 50 people on location ready to shoot. So not only do we have a camera unit, which was a uh, camera car, we also had B unit, which was setting up at different vistas. And we had a behind the scenes crew, which was also filming both those crews. And you also had the aerial unit, which we had a drone that was flying over the scenes, getting some really cool shots from above. Sonoma Raceway is a very interesting track. It's a fast raceway, lots of ups and downs. A lot of curved section, which makes it very visually interesting. When we're shooting running footage on the track, it's essential having a vehicle like the Ultimate Arm. It's essentially a five-man setup, including the director inside. And, and you can create these dynamic visuals of the vehicle peering and peeking and diving down around these little dips and valleys. And so as we're moving, we are trying to create energy, so we are driving at speeds. The dance between the camera car and the picture car is very, very important. The real danger of the vehicle is, is that we have the camera on a crane, and that crane is actually swooping all around the vehicle at speed. Everything is planned out and thought about, and there's a great deal of communication. With the Ultimate Arm, we're sitting with about $2 million worth of product on there. Something quickly can go wrong on a turn when we're actually swooping the camera around. That's where the dangers really start to happen. So in order to get the precise movements, and they had Randy Popes come in. Why we like Randy is that he knows how to react with the camera car. So one of the cool things about this ad was the fact that they were going to make it snow on the track. So they wanted to show off how well the car handles over different types of elements. We hired a company out of San Francisco to bring in two 18-wheelers filled with ice. Rolled those trucks onto the raceway and then they basically threw it into a snowblower and just piled massive amounts of snow onto the racetrack. And we had marked off a certain area. And so when the snow guys got there, they were a little bit overwhelmed about how much space we had to cover. Now it was 72 degrees that day, so obviously they needed to do it as quickly as possible, but also lay out snow over a large amount. As the snow was landing, things were getting a little bit slushy out there. As soon as we saw that the snow was melting that quickly, every single camera that was on the production was lined up and we all shot at the same time.
A lot of people come together on these two days of shooting and work really hard to produce the actual shots. We accomplished what we set out to do. You know, we were able to capture some really cool running footage. It turned out phenomenal. So here it is, our Hyundai Genesis commercial. The all-new Hyundai Genesis was invited to the Sonoma Raceway to demonstrate some of its key performance features. With intelligent drive mode, the Hyundai Genesis can alter steering, transmission, throttle, and suspension, tailored to your driving condition. And with the available continuous damping control, the Genesis suspension is always at work. Pushing the limits of the H-Track all-wheel drive system, snow was dropped on the Sonoma Raceway. Available on the Hyundai Genesis 3.8 liter V6, the H-Track all-wheel drive system improves stability, control, and grip, sending power to the tires that need it most. The all-new 2015 Hyundai Genesis delivers performance to meet the demand of the most demanding. Inner strength, outer beauty. This is the genesis of what's next. Well, normally I like to do a few dance moves with Chanel and go back to the 70s, and we're working on that rock your baby move like this. Woman, take the... Oh, oh, she says we got to change sides. But that's like the big Fig Newton. It's the tricky part. Here's the tricky part. The big... Big. I was trying to remember the name of the move. Right there. Oh. <laughs>